uh, since there's a little talk about EQ, we can we can talk about it for a little bit for sure. Because you see on this melody that I've got an EQ on it that was not included in the preset. And basically what it's doing is just removing all the low frequencies and the, it's a dip in a little bit here. And that's because anything that's not a bass is going to have low frequencies that are just clutter for your mix that you might not even be able to hear and they just clutter it up. So for this pad even, rookie mistake, I didn't put an EQ on it. But you can see, look at that flutter down there. Yikes, that's rough and I know we can't hear that. Like there's no way we can hear that. Human ear. So what I would do is just go, go to the first band on the EQ and just sweep all that out so there's no chance of it getting through. Basically, nothing we can hear is, oh yeah, it's down here once the chord goes lower. And that's the safe zone. So that's the main EQ thing that I do on pretty much every track, no matter what. 